So today we are taking on the Alpha King Titan in the beta form and then the alpha form with the Mega Mech. I'm super excited for that Mega Mech, honestly. I really like that thing. But before we do that, I, I need to collect up some more Giga Hearts. I thought it was 10 that you needed. Apparently it's 20. So yeah, we're going to need to decimate some Gigas in the Forbidden Zone. Not too much of an issue with my amazing Max... Uh, what are they called? Max Melee Gigas. There we go. Words are hard sometimes. There we go. Okay, so... Uh, <laughs> Real quick, let's just talk a little bit about this fight because obviously I've been working up towards this for the last while. I've been mutating the crap out of so many creatures. We're going to be using quite a few of them in this fight. Um, they're probably all going to end up like being used in the, in the beta fight. I will say... This is a very strange thing, but I've always felt this. Uh, the, the beta King Titan is more difficult than the alpha. And here's why. You can't use the Mega Mech on the beta if you can on the alpha. So... Yeah, it, it just makes it more difficult because obviously the Mega Mech, it can't single-handedly kill the, the King Titan. I don't think it can anyway. I feel like it could probably take a massive dent out of it, but it can't straight up kill it. So you can use that and it's really cheap to make. All you need to do is kill the beta first. So um, yeah, I, I don't know. I feel like the beta is much more difficult because of the fact that you cannot use something that's absolutely ridic ridiculous and, and insane and pretty easy to get somewhat at least you know you need that one module to, to combine the max but b beyond that like it's not that difficult it really isn't so anyway i've got so many things ready for this fight and we have six more hearts we only need three more wow i'm, al I'm almost done here god damn look at all these freaking rex arms and everything this map is like the best place to come for uh some apex drops obviously on official you can't transfer them between maps i can because i've got a special stack mod and i'm cool like that but uh, yeah, so anyway, for this fight, we've got all three Titans teamed up, and I have a gigantic army filled with all of the regular kind of creatures that we've been using recently. We got some Shadow Mains, we got some Gigas, I'm bringing some Brachys, we've got Dimorphs, I'm bringing some Trudons, and uh, there's probably some other stuff that I can't even remember right now, but it's all up there, and we just need one more heart, right? Yeah, okay, I don't even see any Gigas around. I feel like we just made them extinct. Let me go over in this direction here. This freaking area is so scary. I gotta say, like, there's so many bad things in here. Although it is a super good area to come for all of these drops, though. Especially on this map, because these boss fights are not cheap on this map at all. Uh, yeah, I can see way more gigas than I need. But that's okay. I might just decimate all these dudes and then hit straight up. So, guys, go ahead. Do me a favor. Hit the like button if you find yourself enjoying this one. And, um, this is gonna be an awesome fight. I'm super excited for this, honestly. It's gonna be so crazy. Uh, ooh, let's just defeat these last few guys and then we can probably try to run off that edge or something and get the hell out of here. I don't even know. All right, there we go. I'm so glad that these corrupted gigas don't do bleed because my guy would almost be dead if they did. Um, there we go. Anyway, let's, uh, let's try and get out of here now. I can't move. <laughs> I'm getting stuck at all this stuff. Oh, you know what? One more thing I should probably mention is I had to unfortunately add in a mod, which uh, basically makes it so the Titans are permanent. It adds in two items. This one here is a life extender, which basically keeps their food stat up, which means that they cannot starve. And then the other one reverses that. So two items. I think it's called like Titan uh, permanent mod or something. I can't remember. <laughs> anyway, yeah. If you just type in like Titan fix, you'll, you'll definitely find it. Um, I needed that because I actually do want to keep the Desert Titan after this. I'm okay if the other two die, but at some point we're going to make a really cool uh, sky base with the Desert Titan. It won't be over on this map. It's going to be on a different map. So I could probably remove that mod from this map when we move the Titan. But uh, yeah, after that, <laughs> I'm, I'm hopefully planning on keeping that thing alive after today. Anyway, uh, I think we could probably hop out of here now. I don't think there's too many things around. Ooh, yeah, no, there's some guys materializing behind me. All right, let me show you guys the army because, oh man, look at this. We've got gigas for days. We've got like 20 brackies. I've even got the max speed one in here. I don't have any use for it. There's the ice titan rendering in. Um, <laughs> I have a bunch of Trudons down there. I think it's like 100. We've got um, a crap ton of Gigas here as well. So many Shadow Mains. We got more over there. All three Titans. And check this out. Up top, we've got <laughs> that giant thing right there. That like ball of wings is, uh, is I, I think like 150 Dimorphs or something like that. Um, and yeah, we, we just got so many things here. I do have some backups down the hill as well. And uh, I did also find some Straggler Gigas around the place. So... I'm gonna have to go ahead and chuck these dudes out as well. They were the ones that got blasted off into oblivion um, last time when I fought the 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 Gamma King Titan. So 
gonna have to let these dudes join in on the fun because they did not get to do that last time honestly this feels like end game for like arc or something you know like we've just got so many things i love the brackies that's that's gonna be hilarious now obviously i know the majority of these creatures are gonna die it's not too much of an issue honestly the most annoying part about doing all of this is just leveling up the creatures like the gigas and the shadow mains i didn't bother leveling the trudons i don't really care they're all gonna die anyway uh the brackies i also did level all of their melee up and um yeah this <laughs> is ridiculous looking uh, all right let me just do some final prep and, and checking around and also i gotta drop some items down the hill and then we should be good to go with this what the hell oh my god look at all those poops that's so many all right here we go beta king titan i gotta say i'm pretty nervous for this one but yeah let's do it all right we're gonna hop onto the ice titan i'm gonna probably just start shooting at this thing with his weird ice snot things and um yeah let's uh let's see how this goes we have a lot of guys so this really i mean i don't think it's gonna take forever i i feel like this is probably going to be a uh a pretty quick ish fight maybe like 10 minutes i don't know we'll see anyway here we go snot balls let's go here we go did we shoot that first one it's very hard to tell because if i turn the titan at all we're gonna have issues wait wait why aren't you guys going in oh yeah i forgot to whistle oh my god i thought i already did that okay here we go 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 why aren't okay there we go perfect Okay, look at those little Trudons going in. They're all gonna die all at once. But it's gonna be kind of funny. Oh my god, he's getting obliterated. Also, these freaking ice balls do like so much damage. 20,000 per hit. That's insane. Okay. Yeah, I think um I think the 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 Titans or something. Well, right now he's got his resistance on. But the Titans, I think, deal like five times damage or something to uh the King Titans. So it's very useful to use them for sure. Uh, I kind of want these Brackies to go in a little bit we already have one or two in there but oh my god it's so framey right now oh there we go okay they are going in apparently cool okay he's gonna do a giant power punch and that's gonna be bad because it's gonna knock everybody back but there's really nothing we could do at this point unless uh, oh my god okay here we go i think he's gonna do it Ooh, this is gonna be bad oh my god it's so framey okay i'm gonna have to do that okay and we couldn't see anything dying there unfortunately but i just had to do that because otherwise this video would be awful to look at. Um, okay. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> this is so intense. Okay. Oh my god, he's at like half health already. No way. Okay, dudes, get in there. Come on. Brackies, get in there, man. Come on. Giant neckbeards. Defend your queen. Your queen being me. Wait, what? How did the dimorphs get in? What? Okay, cool. The dimorphs are going in for some reason. Um really feel like i should just run in there and start biting at them or something but the snot balls do a lot of damage well not right now but you know what i mean uh not everything does a lot of i guess pretty much everything right how pretty much everything right now is doing like no damage so yeah um okay come on we gotta just start shooting them forward i'm really confused how that one went backwards did i like turn the camera slightly oh these guys are not very fun to ride on i'm gonna be honest uh wow he's almost already dead Okay, power punch time. Ooh, it's gonna be bad. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> There's so many dead gigas. All right, I'm gonna get in there. Here we go. Am I am I close? I can't even tell what's happening. The die are just dying everywhere. Ah, oh, can I hit? I'm trying to hit. It's not okay. Now it's allowing me. Perfect. Okay. Oh, is he dead? No, no, he's not. Wait, is he? Oh no, he is. What the hell just happened there? His health. He had loads of health, and then it all just went away interesting right well how much damage do you take not not actually that much to be honest um god this dude is gigantic again really annoyed that you can't get a dermis from it it's really stupid i'm gonna have to basically you know force tame one to be able to get a dermis which i will do because i i feel the need to you know i i deserve dermises i deserve nice nice dermises uh so i will be doing that and i don't care uh, yeah let's uh let's fly out of here i'm not gonna ascend until we defeat the alpha so yeah makes sense in my mind i don't know uh i kind of like the idea of of doing it on the last fight instead of all three so yeah we didn't bother um these are basically worthless to me i might actually go ahead and grind the two of these one thing to note is that the only thing that really matters 
on these things is the shield uh these guys right here do not do any extra damage at all doesn't matter uh they do a base amount of damage and it's really silly that you can get better than primitive on them uh but we did get our mega mech thing it's apparently called a mommy um <laughs> uh yeah cool all right sweet so um well, we'll uh we'll probably go ahead and do that i do think that we have to wait six hours though before i do the next one right i'm pretty sure that that's a thing so i might have to just sit around for absolutely ages waiting to uh to do the next fight so i guess i could probably reorganize these dudes and try to heal them a little bit but like the sky is just dead gigas everywhere let's see that took like less than five minutes that's insane all right look at these dudes oh my god that one's really bad oh this one's pretty bad too but this one's worse this is like the the two stages of this type of death for a giga you know this one's pretty bad but like this one he twisted it even more it's eating its own neck i don't even understand how that's possible this one right here i don't know i feel like this one kind of wants me to paint it or something um yeah this is like my favorite part about like giant boss fights like this oh you know what this might be the the third stage of the weird neck eating bit um <laughs> but yeah like boss fights after when you just look at all your dead dinos it's it's just hilarious looking this one right here his jaws have swapped places um also yeah they're backwards or whatever oh he's no he's going goodbye and he's gone cool all right uh well yeah there we go we lost a lot of creatures during that but that's okay like i said you know all these guys are here they're expendable they are made to be in this boss fight so that's completely fine um yeah let me uh let me just reorganize everybody and i'm pretty sure i do have to wait six hours but i will attempt and see if we can do it all right so one thing that i do want to mention about the mega mech because i saw a lot of comments from people and i just really want to warn you guys so when you're getting yourself a mega mech please never ever use anything better than primitive mechs if you use a really good mech you're wasting it because it does not matter what type of mechs you use you get the same base stats no matter what the mega mech will always be identical no matter what you use so you just need four regular mechs you know and they're you know somewhat cheap to be honest so they're not that hard to actually get and uh yeah of course you know we we mount one and then we we put the module on there it is i'll probably do that you know after i'm gonna get rid of that as well i'm getting rid of all this loot because i have a really good gotcha farm i don't need any of it it's just weighing me down uh but yeah so please never never use really good max i got so many comments when i made my really really good mech a couple episodes ago and i was just like oh my god these people need to know so i figured i'd mention it here which kind of makes a lot of sense anyway um let's uh let's do this if we can i'm pretty sure we do have to wait six hours but i'm just gonna see if i can what else do i need i need this this and the spino sails right okay pretty sure we have to wait yeah five five hours 54 minutes okay cool it's fine um that's that's fine <laughs> at least these dudes will have some time to heal anyway um any more guys following me because they all just keep running up to me i did bring okay yeah we still have a couple of dudes down here that's fine i'm just gonna oh my god there's quite a lot of them wow they are all completely stuck here i'm gonna leave some of them here at least because I, I do want some stuff just as backup in case i need it you see if everything all goes in at once you know they can all hit him and hurt him and everything but as soon as he does some crazy punches they're all gonna die all at once as well so the best way is to kind of send in waves but um yeah hopefully the forest titan will actually do things this this boss fight i was actually kind of assuming that he was gonna start attacking but he didn't at all so that's cool uh hopefully i get out of this next fight with all three titans alive definitely the desert titan i'm gonna need but the other two i think it'd be cool to have them and maybe use them on other maps as well i don't really feel like i want to make a base on every single one of them seriously how are you still following me but um you know what maybe we could do some cool stuff with them anyway either way though we have to wait like six hours so i'll see you guys on the other side okay so six hours later and now we are ready to fight the king titan and make this mega mech so here we go let's do that and now i gotta power run my way over to my mega max i did move everything around them just like slightly further away just in case oh my god we're having some laggities right now just in case um you know things might get stuck on me or whatever i was very worried about the uh the forest titan getting completely just stuck on me and and not allowing me to move or something that will be bad but here we go uh i gotta quickly just grab a dermis actually it's unfortunate that i have to do this right now but this is my only way of getting it all right here we go everybody in uh oh i'm not able to move 
What the hell's happening? Wait, what? Oh, now I'm able to move. Oh, that was weird. I didn't like that. Okay, here we go. So, how much am I doing? I can't even tell which is me. Uh, oh, well, he's doing 40,000 damage, and he does stun the mech quite a lot. But I don't know. Hopefully, we'll be able to do this. We are getting the uh, the dudes in down there. Uh, they're, they're hitting him a good amount. We need to get more in, though, unfortunately. Uh, we're doing 16,000 damage with this swing, by the way. Uh, now we're doing less because he's got his resistance on. Uh, here we go. Okay, let me see. Can I get these dudes in on him? Like, unfortunately, I'm super high up, so there's really no actual way of doing this unless he... They are on neutral. Like, you would just have to hurt them. This is kind of annoying. Okay, those Gekas are going in because they just got hurt by his fireball thing. But, like, everything else around is, is not going in. We got the Forest Titan in, though. I just noticed that. The Ice Titan's just chilling, though. Come on, bro. Get over here. Get in on this fight. Look at this giant thing. We need to kill it together, you and me. Uh, and the Forest Titan. <laughs> and all the Gekas. And the Brackies. And everything else. All right. Well, anyway, this freaking Mega Mech is so cool. Like, this is honestly one of the coolest things in Ark. I kind of wish he did have a cannon on his arm, though. Just like the normal small mechs. But you know what? We do have the fist we can punch. We've got the giant sword, which is crazy looking. Uh, he's going to do his crazy power punch and in the second here probably kind of nervous about that how's the forest titan looking um that's his health right there and it's not even dropped at all i guess he's not even getting hit right yeah don't think so well anyway the brackies are coming in <laughs> oh man i'm so glad i put everything onto neutral uh he's just gonna be doing this for a while i know that we have that thing back there that i could potentially go back and defend or whatever but honestly i don't care about that part of the fight i'd rather just you know continuously hit him instead of you know doing that and then potentially dying or whatever that would be annoying uh here comes the power punch though we gotta we gotta make sure we don't fly off this arena actually i'm gonna have to okay there we go i just wanted to be closer to him so he wouldn't shoot me really far back um okay ice titan you need to get in there come on bro what are you doing can you not hear this whistle come on there really should be increased range of these whistles though like it's kind of annoying the way that they have it oh my god he okay we gotta stop this power punch He's doing the super power punch. We don't like that. Ice Titan, get in here, man. What the hell are you doing? Stop just staring at me. He's even watching me. Okay, I think we stopped his power punch. Yeah, you don't want him to do that one. That one does a lot of damage from what I remember. Okay, he's doing the spitballs. That's bad. He is like halfway dead though, so we're doing really good. That Forest Titan, I think, is the one doing 26,000 damage. Ice Titan, come on. Come on, bro. What the hell are you doing? God, these fights are so annoying to do solo. Okay, how's my Mega Mech doing? Oh my god, I've got a lot of health left. Let's see. 380-ish thousand. Not freaking bad, man. That's uh oh look, we got more dimorphs. Sweet, they're all coming in. <laughs> they're all like hitting them with the 95 damage. That's amazing. Okay. Uh Ice Titan. I really want to jump down and and Okay, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Come on. Get in there, bro. What are you doing? Get in there. Ice Titan, come on! <laughs> Get in there! Dude, don't just look at me. Get in there. What are you doing? Oh my God, he's dumb. He's got brain worms. He, his corruption came back. He's he's on the King Titan side. I don't know how to make him fight. He doesn't want to. <laughs> All right, well, anyway, let's continue fighting. Like, I just really wish he would come in because he does a lot of damage, you know? The Forest Titan is the tank out of all three. The, you know... The Desert Titan is the support, and then the Ice Titan's kind of just, you know, the, the, the killer. He's, he's like the melee one. Um, oh my god, that stunned me quite a lot. But yeah, like, him, him not getting in there is kind of annoying. Like, will he please go in and fight for me? Like, bro. Like, I don't understand how he's not getting whistled. Like, I'm whistling Gigas. He just doesn't care. Whatever. It's fine. <laughs> he's not stuck. He's just lazy. Uh, all right. Well, anyway, uh, we're five minutes into this fight and we're almost done. That's insane. Okay. Th yeah. As you can see though, like the Mega Mech really does absolutely slay, you know, <laughs> you just got to have other stuff in here to help you out. Like, otherwise you would not be able to do it. Just like, look at this thing. It's so cool looking. It really truly is. Like, this is one of the coolest things in Ark. Like a giant, basically like Voltron. <laughs> We've got Voltron. You assemble it just like Voltron as well, kind of, sort of. Uh, here we go. Except it's, you know, it's only like four pieces instead of five. All right, he's going to do super power punch. No! Oh, come on, Ice Titan. You definitely felt that one, maybe. No, I don't think he did. Okay, come on. Oh, I'm coming for you, boy. Wait, is, is Forest Titan alive? He is. 
I can't see his health bar. He's totally alive though. Okay, well, here we go. We're getting down to the end of it here. Oh, he's, he's angry at me. <gasps> oh, he's doing the super power punch. We've got to stop him. Come on, let me swing. Let me, let me, oh, he's changing direction. I can't swing. There we go. Okay. Keep punching, man. The punch is a lot quicker. There we go. Oh, self-destruct. Goodbye, Mega Mac. <laughs> oh, there we go. We did it. I did it. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> all right i'm gonna put all my stuff and the rewards onto a shadow main which no you know what i'm gonna put it onto something i'll be able to tell where it is let's put it onto night owl let's put night owl like over over here somewhere let me just grab this this stuff first so i want to be in here if i want to ascend which is going to be kind of annoying you know i do like the idea of ascending but hear me out um it means that i'm gonna no longer have an implant which is kind of sad <laughs> Uh, what am I looking for? You know what? Wyvern. There we go. Blood boy. Here we go. Uh, I'm pretty sure that this wipes all your gear. So I just, I want to be sure that I'm not going to lose any of this stuff. How the hell are these things falling on the ground? That doesn't make any sense. Come on. Here we go. Boom. Drop it all in. And now I got to run over there and be inside the circle. <gasps> Come on. Don't ascend without me. Okay. Here we go. So yeah. Ascension. Here we come. No mistake. This is all thanks to you. I'm just glad I got to see it. <gasps> Look at that. Sun's arising. Well, there we have it. That is the lovely cutscene. Um, okay, no hate, okay? But I have to be honest. I do not like the uh, <laughs> the new Helena's um, rendition of that scene. Watch the original. Uh, oh my God, every, all the textures are all weird. What the hell's happening here? Watch the original version of that scene. You know, the one from um, the original actress who did Helena. Um, and then and then watch rewatch that. Like that one is just not as good. I just don't think so. Uh, there's there's a lot less. Um, I don't know. There's like a lot less heart behind what she's actually saying. Uh, like 
to me that really just feels like she's reading from a script and i don't think that she's like that for everything but i think that this is such a crucial part of the arc story you know why would they not get her to do another take i i just i seriously don't think that that was good um not not as good as the first one it's definitely not um now again no hate like i think that she does a great job with the rest of all the helena stuff but i just would have preferred if they didn't come back and 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 change this one but uh yeah anyway that's just my thoughts on it i know quite a few people actually don't even like this new actress i i think that she's great you know but again this this particular thing it should have ha it should have carried more weight behind it and i really feel like there should have been another take a lot of that was just i don't know it seriously just feels like she's reading from a script um but anyway yeah no no actual hate you know just my opinion anyway uh there we go we have the alpha king titan on the implant now which is awesome because i don't know if you guys remember originally even though you would get this you know new version of the implant which is not actually an implant plant i can't even speak but you know what i mean um originally it didn't even say alpha king titan on there uh that that's somewhat new they they fixed that not uh, probably about a year or two ago but like after after the dlc being out for like two years they finally fixed it um I just found that really funny. But here we go. With it. We got the uh, the Homodeus skins. Do I have a full set of armor I could just put on? I don't want to have to put it onto my tech armor, which actually is not even possible anyway. Let's see. Let me pop all this stuff on. And the last piece. Boom. Look at me. It's Homodeus in tech. And wait, let's do this. Boom. <laughs> what, what we should do is we should remake that whole scene except put me as Helena instead. Um, <laughs> just... just grab this right here and put this into that scene i look very very strange look a lot less bulky um i guess it's because i have no skin but anyway yeah there we go <laughs> this skin set is so weird looking it really is wait I, i'm kind of curious uh let's let's take off the feet there we go boom so now i'm just feet <laughs> <laughs> well anyway there we go guys that is the alpha king titan defeated we have the dermis of the mega mech which is awesome um we lost so many creatures um opening up the tribe log would, would just be kind of, kind of pointless i mean you can see them all here like th this whole thing's just gonna be death you know <laughs> like <laughs> so many things died we got like one bracky left i think i don't see oh we got another one over here yeah uh we still have all three titans though which is great the forest titan he was the mvp of that boss fight um he's uh wait can i mount you there we go he is uh he's not even that hurt i mean to be honest yeah he didn't really actually get hit much like that you, oh crap i just yeah i just realized that was about to happen but it's okay i got a lot of health so we're not gonna die from like a little fall like that or any fall actually because you can't take more than 400 ish damage i think right something like that well anyway yeah um so yeah i don't know the uh the king titan was like mainly focused on me which is which is kind of interesting i mean i guess if i was the king titan i would also be focused on the gigantic robot that wants to kill you but um yeah we still have the wait did you get hurt you must have gotten hit by some meteors or something because you are a little bit hurt up there. Crazy. Um, This Giga right here looks like he had some fun. Well, anyway, yeah, there we go, guys. That is it. Um, <laughs> This Giga's arm looks so weird. I don't know why. It looks very strange. It looks... Wait, 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 wait. Okay, wait, wait. Take this image right here. Put a basketball in his hand, please. Somebody do that. Um, put a, We got a Reddit. Put it on the Reddit. Um... <laughs> But yeah, there we go. Anyway, boss fight was crazy. Um, there we go. We uh, we have defeated the King Titan. And now, you know, we didn't get any rewards for it besides really cool germses that I'll eventually get. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put you three away. And we got some plans for you, Mr. Desert Titan. We'll probably do that on a different map. I don't want to make the Desert Titan base on this map because that would mean I would never be able to summon in another Desert Titan which is obviously not what I want. So I don't know, what map should I make a floating like sky base with this dude? I'm thinking Crystal Isles, but I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. And also we're gonna need some names for all three of them because apparently they're all alive now and that's great. But anyway, yeah, that is it. And I'll catch you guys in the next one.